Hello, everyone. The Anthony S. You're not alone. I want to talk today about you and what you're doing and how awesome you are because a lot of these podcasts are about a topic or about something that's going on with me. But every once in a while, I like to say it, it really is about you and what you're going through. And that's why it's called You're Not Alone. It's because I'm trying to relay the message that I understand. A lot of things in life get in the way. And it seems the harder you push, the more that gets in the way. And it gets the it gets even to the more deeper to a point of it's almost not worth it, it feels like. You feel like you want to quit. And uh, I just want to say you should. There's a reason why the 1% is the 1%. At least for people that made their own money. Yes, there's some people that are going to be trust fund babies and they're going to have everything given to them. But at the same token, they don't have that drive that you will. And it's because of the fact that you have to fight so hard and win so many times more than those people. Those individuals tend to be less happy because they'll never be able to get out of the shadow of who made their money. So I'm bringing it back to say, you're doing great. You're doing awesome. Stick to the basics. Stick to what you know is right in your own process. Don't try to get fancy with it. Don't try to extend past your means. If it takes a little longer than you expected, okay, that's how it goes. Don't worry about that too much. Just know that you're willing to put in that hard work. Don't discredit yourself from that. Don't discredit the last two or three years or even two or three days that you've put in the effort. Keep going. Doesn't matter how many times you lose or fail. Yes, you have responsibilities. Okay, get the second, get a first job at night. Get make some way to get the bills paid. Okay, that's great. But all the other time, keep your effort going. Don't give up. Don't stop. Don't allow the world that you live in to create who you are. Be you in the world. Show others that you care about what it means to live. Do not deny them that that light that you have. And I won't say it's a responsibility to do something. But if you're someone who has the drive and the light and kindness and empathy, patience... It's not a responsibility, but there is some sort of a duty. And that's the person I'm talking to right now. I'm talking to you, that individual that has put it in and is a little down because 2018 didn't go how you wanted. Or 2015 to 2018 or 2010 to 2018. The last decade. I get it. Especially now, there's a lot of weird stuff going on. For individuals that are under the age of 20, it's probably the, it might be a, an annoying time or a bad time. But overall, it's one of the best times to be alive. There's so much opportunity that for you to give up because of someone else's words on a YouTube comment or because your mom said so, come on. We're not here to knit. Unless your company's knitting, then you're here to knit. That's what I'm talking about. But for everyone else, you're here to do what you do best. You're not here to slow down because of people's opinions. You're not here to slow down because you lost the first hundred times. You're here to achieve. You're here to be happy. Don't waste doing anything else. Either be successful in terms of uh, financially and wellness, or be happy, or both. It's pointless being sad, pointless thinking about other things that don't matter, pointless dwelling on the past, fearing the future. Those are all tasks that are not required. You do not have to do that. Be happy. Be successful. Be both. Find someone in the middle you like. Whatever you got to do. I believe in you. I know you can do it. And this five minutes was just for you.
Talk to you all soon.